Hello everyone, I'm meteorologist Violet Skyber. The official winter outlook is in and it was just issued by NOAA or the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration. And this winter it's calling for a La Nina event. And I will explain what that means and the impacts it'll have in the United States during this upcoming winter season. So let's head over to the Pacific Ocean where we have trade winds moving from east to west. During a La Nina event, those trade winds become stronger and it displaces a lot of warm ocean water off to the west. And then we have swelling, which means the colder ocean water on the eastern side starts to lift up and moves to the surface. So we have this cold ocean water over the western side of the United States, and that's what really impacts our weather systems here in the upcoming winter. So what this does is it takes the Pacific jet, which is normally on the southern part of the, the United States, and shoves it northward. And it causes this cooler air to start dropping in across the northwestern part of, of the United States, along with our weather systems that follow this jet stream. So with the weather systems following this jet stream, that means we're going to have some wetter systems on the western side of the states and towards the Great Lakes region and south of the Ohio Valley as well, with drier and warmer weather for the southern and southeastern part of the states. And we have variable temperatures along this part of the polar jet just because weather systems have a cool side and a warm side to them. So we usually see pretty big temperature swings up here in the Northeast and the Great Lakes region during this. Hopefully this clears up any confusion about the La Nina event. You can always reach out to me with more questions that you have.